hi and welcome to a new tutorial this is a quick tutorial I want to show you how we make this triangle shell with all these shell stitches we only have to do repeat two rows let's get started I use a 5 mm crochet hook by my choice of yarn row 1 we make a slip knot on the hook and start with a chain 5 so 1 2 3 4 5 your first 4 chain stitches counts for a first treble and the 5th chain stitch counts for a chain now here in the first chain stitch after that slip stitch here on the hook we make one double crochet so yarn over into the hook in that first chain grab your yarn and pull up yarn over pull for two yarn over and pull for two now we make a chain three one two and three now back in that same stitch where you make that double crochet in that first chain make a new double crochet yarn over and the hook for a second time in that same chain stitch grab your yarn pull up yarn over pull to two yarn over and pull for two make one chain and now back in that same stitch where you make that two double crochets go back in that same stitch with a treble yarn twice over the hook one and two go back in that same stitch grab your yarn pull up yarn over pull for two yarn over pull for two yarn over and pull for two and row one is complete row 2 and we make a chain now turn your work upside down and now here in that first stitch here in that little cap place your hook in and make a single crochet so grab your yarn pull up yarn over and pull for two now here in that first chain one space we make seven double crochets all in that same space yarn over and to hook in that space, grab your yarn, pull up, yarn over, pull for two, yarn over, pull for two. For the first double crochet, the first of seven. Yarn over, back in that same space, make one double crochet, that's two. Back in that same space, three, four, five. six and seven seven double crochets all in that same space now here in that chain three go in with your hook and make one single crochet so in that space grab your yarn pull up yarn over and pull for two now skip over the next chain one space and make seven double crochets all in that same space for a new shell so yarn over Enter your space in that last, in that last space. So one double crochet back in that same space. Two back in that same space. Three, four, five, six, and seven. Now on the top of the first treble, and that's the chain four, on the top of that chain four, make one single crochet. So one, two, three, and here's number four. Go in with your hook in that in that stitch, not in that in that space, but in that stitch. Yeah. Yarn over, pull up, yarn over, and pull for two. And this is what we have now.
Row 3 and we start with and chain 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now turn your work. Now here in that first stitch make one double crochet. So yarn over and to you here in that first stitch make one double crochet. And this is our first V stitch. Now make a chain 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And now we skip over all these 7 double crochets. And then here in that single crochet, here in the middle, we make a new V stitch. 1 double crochet in that stitch. So yarn over, enter hook here in that single crochet. Make one double crochet, then make a chain one and a double crochet back in that same stitch for a new V stitch. We make a new point of our shell and that's in chain three. One, two, three. Now back in that same stitch we make another V stitch. One double crochet in that same stitch and chain one and one double crochet back in that same single crochet stitch. Now we have here two V stitches between and chain three. Make a chain five, one, two, three, four and five. We skip all over these seven double crochets and then here on the top of your really first stitch here we make a new V stitch one double crochet on that last stitch here in the beginning then make a chain one and now we make in that same stitch not a double but a treble crochet yarn twice over Back in that same stitch, pull a loop, yarn over, pull to two, yarn over, pull to two, yarn over, and pull for two. And we're done with the row with the V stitches. We start with a chain. Now turn your work. And now here in that first stitch in that little gap here, make one single crochet. Now here below, into that first chain one space, make seven double crochets all in that same space. That's one in that same space, two. Three, four, five, six, and seven for a new shell. Now we join this chain five to that first shell here below into the fourth double crochet so one two three and four in that stitch we make one single crochet and we work also around that chain five so enter your hook in that fourth double crochet so one two three four in that stitch and grab your yarn and pull up and you work also around that chain five so you yarn over and pull through two Now we skip the next chain stitches here and then into the next V stitch make in that chain one space a new shell of seven double crochets. So yarn over in that chain one space seven double crochets. That's one, two, three, four, 
five, six, and seven for a new shell. Now here on the top of that chain three, make one single crochet in that space. Now move over to the next V stitch in that chain one, make seven double crochets in that chain one space. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven for a new shell. Now here that chain five, we want to join this, that chain five to that next shell of that seven double crochet. And then in the fourth double crochet of that shell, it's one, two, three, and four, and that stitch here, we make one single crochet and we work also around that chain five. Grab your yarn, pull up, yarn over and pull for two. Now we move over to the next V stitch here on the end and make seven double crochets in that space. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven double crochets all in that last same V stitch. Now on the top of the first double crochet of the treble crochet and that's in the fourth chain stitch we make one single crochet. So one, two, three, then in the fourth chain stitch make one single crochet and then the row of all the shells are complete. And this is only what we have to do. We make now a V stitch row and then on the back row we make all the shells. We begin with the V stitch row and we begin with a chain six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Turn our work and now on the top of the very first stitch make one double crochet. For your first V stitch. Make a chain five. One, two, three, four, five. And now we skip all these double crochets that shell. And then in the single crochet here you make one new uh, V stitch of one double crochet in that stitch. It's in that single crochet. Then in chain one and back in that same stitch with another double crochet for new V stitch. Make a chain five, one, two, three, four, and five. Now we skip all these seven double crochets of the next shell, and then on the top of the single crochet here, make a new V stitch of one double crochet chain one, one double crochet back in that same stitch. Now we make a new point of a chain three. One, two and three. Now back here in that same stitch where we make that V stitch, we make a new V stitch. One double crochet in that stitch, then a chain one, back in that same stitch with another double crochet. Make a chain five. One, two, three, four, five. Then we skip all these double crochets of the next shell. And then here on the single crochet, you make a new V stitch of one double crochet in that single crochet. And chain one, 
one double crochet back in that same stitch of V stitch make a chain 5 1 2 3 4 5 you skip the next 7 double crochets and now you're on the top of the first stitch make a new double crochet in that stitch it's the beginning of the new V stitch and chain and then back in that same stitch with a travel yarn twice over in that same stitch and make a travel one two three times pull through two loops and the next row we start on the new shells we make a chain one turn our work and in the very first stitch here make one single crochet now we in the first V stitch make a new shell of seven double crochets in that space spawn two three four five six and seven for a new shell now we join the chain five to the next shell into the fourth double crochet it's one two three four and to hook in that stitch go also around that chain five and make one single crochet in that stitch now we skip over to the next V stitch and make a new shell of seven double crochets in that space one two three four five six and seven a new shell and we do again join that chain 5 to the next shell here count four stitches four double crochets of that shell one two three four and to you in that stitch grab your yarn and pull up and work also around that chain 5 and make one single crochet we skip over to the next V stitch for that chain 3 here make 7 double crochets in that V stitch so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 now here in the point chain three space make one single crochet in that space then in the next V stitch seven double crochets for new shell one two three four five six and seven for a new shell then again that chain five must be joined here on the shell here below in the fourth double crochet so one two three four in that stitch around that chain five make one single crochet in that stitch now we skip over to the next V stitch in that V stitch, seven double crochets. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. For a new shell. And then again here below that shell and that chain five. We join together with a single crochet in the fourth double crochet of that shell. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. 
three, four in that stitch and make one single crochet. Now we are in the last V spa stitch space here, seven double crochets in that space, in that last space, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven for new shell. Now on the fourth chain stitch here in the beginning, you make one single crochet. It's one, it's one, two, three, and four in that stitch. Make one single crochet. And the row of the shells are complete and this is only what you have to do. You repeat again with to make all those V stitches and then go back with all the shells. Then V stitches and repeat all those shells. So many times on and on as you want do you find your shell is big enough. And you start with your first V stitch with a chain six. Then turn and make on the top of the very first stitch one double crochet for your first V stitch. Now make a chain five, skip over all these double crochets of the next shell, and then on the top of the next single crochet you work a new V stitch, one double crochet, chain one, one double crochet, chain five, in the next single crochet, a new V stitch, one double crochet, chain one, one double crochet, chain five, and then here make that top corner, a V stitch, then a chain three, and a V stitch back in that same stitch. Work like this on and on and work your shell complete. And this is how it looks like after a few more rows. And this is only what you have to do. Are you here for the first time? Then please subscribe to my channel. Click on the bell so you don't miss any new videos from me. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!